Good morning. Good morning. Grand Rising. I see Miss Vivian uh, Simpson in the building. Good morning, DJ. We got Miss Elaine Davis. Good morning, DJ and chat. We got Miss Portia G. Good morning, uh, DJ. Was just listening to your your last live. Let's get it. Uh, Miss uh, Carpenter, you're on early, uh, Bird. Uh, you're on early, Bird, DJ. Uh, I'm just making my coffee morning friends. Well, you know, the early bird always catch the worm. I am a early person anyway. So of course <laughs> I get up early. Uh, yesterday I, I went to bed, uh, early. Uh, I know that there was some cocksuckers with my name in their mouth. So of course, <laughs> you know, that there's going to be a response, um, uh as always you know that's that's what i do uh miss fran is in the building good morning dj and chat we got candy jones coming through the clutches it is what it is baby uh we got kj in the building good morning uh kj uh mr k judah just got off and seen my beloved dj live aka the truth much love from kj all right k judah is in the building y'all make sure y'all subscribe to k judah uh, very intellectual brother, very deep brother. I had the privilege to listen to one of your lives the other day. Uh, very, very, very inter interesting. And like I said, he's a deep, deep thinker, of course. And his commentary is indeed powerful. Uh, if you have that type of intellect that you can go there mentally, uh, you need to go ahead and uh, lock in. Uh, the brother is sharp. I like sharp people, you know, people that have a mind of their own. You know, I'm a deep thinker myself, KJ. So, you know, they say iron sharp and iron. So, you know, it is what it ain't, baby. But uh, y'all make sure that y'all go ahead and tap into uh, K Judah. He's the real deal. Pieces of Me is in the building. Good morning, DJ and Steppers. Uh, in therapy, listening. Uh, by the time this shit is over, I might need to come and join, come and join you and give me some damn therapy. I don't know. It's uh, it's uh, it's very very demonic, uh, very dark, uh, very demonic and dark. Uh, when I do commentary on these. Uh, motherfuckers. And, and the only reason why it's so dark and gloomy is because of the past uh, that these people have and the things that they indulge in and what they tapping into. Uh, I have a very, um, you know, some people say it's discernment. I am very humble. I don't like to speak on things that I'm not really privy of. You know what I'm saying? You know, I I I don't do that. But you know, when I got a a, a deep sense of discernment as it relates to things that I've experienced, things that I've witnessed um, in this sector, it's a very weird, strange uh, sector. Um, I, I've been in conversations with individuals that has been following me from the gate that know me in real time. And, and you know, it's dark, it's gloomy. And the reason why it's so dark and gloomy is because uh, I believe uh, that these people that's among us all, uh, these people have dark, deep secrets. Uh, these people are tapping into a lot of explicit demonic shit. And uh, that spirit, it, 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 it will follow you. It will follow you. Uh, a lot of these motherfuckers are broken, uh, broken pieces. Uh, they are not in a position to heal nobody. Uh, one thing that I have never came on here to and, and, and did or I, I dab in is try to act like I'm a motherfucking psychiatrist. Uh, I do not uh, have the license. I do not have uh, the ability to assess a, 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 a motherfucker. But I can tell you when something is wrong, people. I can tell you when something is wrong. And I can tell you that this atmosphere, it ain't normal. 
And the reason why it's not normal is because you dealing with a lot of bitches that have deep, dark secrets. There's a lot of trauma. There is been there has been loss of life. There is incest. It could be some trafficking. Uh, kids, uh, pornography. And let me tell you something. When I came out here and talked about the damn enterprise, make no mistake about it. They have they they have validated that shit. They have they have given that name so much power to the point where in they are the motherfucking enterprise and 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 they dab with shit outside of this internet anytime that you're dealing with government agencies anytime that you're tapping into private uh citizens information that goes beyond you damn doing a being ver verified or you coming on and you uh you know doxing somebody's address and no 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 these people go these people tb is intrusive they are wicked but this is what they do this is and 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 the reason why they do that so that is a form of intimidation so whoever that gets among them whoever that's a part of them when they get ready to turn on your ass and get all the information they can about you they then use that against you but i can come and tell you today that they have not been successful as it relates to destiny jenkins that is me real talk with dj and they know this because they have been powerless as it relates to me because when somebody is backing you, when you being backed by a higher source, I don't give a damn about Britney, a.k.a. slow motherfucking tongue coming out here talking about DJ. You don't motherfucking know me. I've never got close to you. I've never let you get close to me. And bitch, you don't know a motherfucking thing about me. And let me just say this to you, Brittany. Um, I don't watch you. I can tell you that. I, I'm not tapping into you like that. Um, but let me throw you a bone. I came out here and I said probably for a month now that fuck Callie. Fuck anybody that's representing Cali. Fuck anybody that's got her back, her side, her front. I meant that shit. I don't miss my motherfucking words. There is not a punk bitch on these YouTube streets that I motherfucking fear. Oftentimes, I will find myself running to it instead of running from it. Uh, false evidence appearing real. I'm not a punk bitch. I can tell you that. I'm not a bitch that sit back and let another trick ass bitch think she gonna talk to me any kind of motherfucking way and it's not gonna be no motherfucking rebuttal. So you better go get the fucking help that you need. But as you getting the motherfucking help that you need, trick bitch, you better be doing your motherfucking homework because motherfucker, the last time I checked, it sucks to be anybody that's affiliated with these motherfuckers because what you're dealing with is a motherfucking coop it's not a cool it's a goddamn uh coop you're dealing with the motherfucking enterprise and a lot of things that you have experienced on this motherfucking app i guarantee you it came from them same motherfuckers that you over there riding they goddamn coattail let me tell you about a let me tell you about a strong motherfucker and strong don't always have to equate to strength, physical. I'm talking about mentally, physically, all the fucking above. I am a very strong-minded bitch, okay? Uh, Y'all like to talk about me behind the motherfucking scenes, but when I come on this bitch, it don't matter. It, it, hey, I talk about all you motherfuckers, and you ain't never seen me having a ride on the coattail of no motherfucking trick-ass bitch. Let me tell you the reason why, because I know who the fuck I am. When I turn on my life, it's up. 
when I cut this live on, anything that I want to talk about, I motherfucking talk about what I want to talk about. I don't ski it through. I don't mint shit. I do what the fuck I want to do on my channel. Don't none of these punk bitches run my narratives. They don't run nothing over here on my motherfucking channel because I'm not a part of you motherfuckers. And that's a privilege indeed. And let me just say this here. Uh, the reason why uh, you, I know that you one of the ones that fuck heavy uh, with the motherfucking enterprise uh, because of Grub Grub, a.k.a. Quinn Quinn, which is a head honcho. Uh, Michelle Quinn. Uh, make no mistake about it. Michelle Quinn, uh, she's been on these goddamn YouTube streets for quite some time. And you was one of the ones, uh, you and Pookie, I gave y'all heads up as it relates to uh, what these motherfuckers was doing, how they was doing it, how they was trying to bring discord. And one of the things that they was able to use was their M-O-N-E motherfucking Y. So don't you ever come at me, motherfucker, because let me tell you something. You what you call a Sambo, a sellout. I don't respect Sambos. I don't respect sellouts. And I don't goddamn respect Conettas. Uh, with that being uh, said, uh, Callie, you better tighten up on your motherfucking square. Uh, bitch, you ain't got a motherfucking circle. You got a square. I'm telling you right now, you better tighten the fuck up. You know, you, you're looking weak out here, baby. You have always went, been weak as it relates to me. Um, you're not a heavy hitter. Uh, you very lightweight. And when it, 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 it fucking with me, bitch, you're going to be calling 911 many times over there having goddamn panic attacks because you talk too goddamn much. And I gave you warning. I said, listen, Callie, I know that you got a dark past. I know this. I know that your past is dark. I know that there's been a lot of trauma. I called the house the trauma house. Whether it was uh, a house that you, uh, you know, I do believe there's a lot of people, and I'm talking in the spiritual realm, there's a lot of people uh, that uh, was in that house, 316 Ash Street, uh, that have experienced a lot of trauma. I don't have to come on here and hit you under the belt, talk about your medical. That is not the way I go with Callie. I don't have to come in here and talk about my, uh, uh, Myron, his death. Uh, I don't do that because, like I said, at the end of the day, uh, the brother did lose his life. I know how to get her in other ways, okay? Um, that, that, that's, that's, that's kitty shit. When I play with Callie and I go after her, I go after her straight up, you know. I, I go after things that you have put out, things that I am aware of. I talk about facts. Uh, these other bitches, they come out here windmilling. I'm not a windmiller. I, I can't stand a motherfucker that sit up and act like they can't get the words out, Callie. <laughs> um, I, I like to... Uh, talk about the things that you all have put out. That's commentary, uh, contesting you on a lot of uh, things that you have said that come out that have came out your mouth. Uh, you are the type of person you you are a, a habitual liar. Uh, you do tell a lot of lies, and anytime you tell a lot of lies, sometimes you get tripped up on the things that you have said in the past. Uh, and, and, and you don't remember the things that you have said, the things that you have done. Um, Y'all have did a hell of a job with these content creators, having these content creators come out here and piggyback off on the fact that she's a mother. She's not a mother. Uh, she did not have Majine. She did not have Myron. Uh, she did not have Juju. And she did not have Majine. I mean, Day Day. So y'all have did a hell of a job coming out here promoting that lie. Uh, you all have perpetuated that fucking lie. And the only reason why you have did that is because of these goddamn agent provocateurs. These agent provocateurs know that if you're coming out here saying that you're going to do a case study on a woman that is, uh, she display distasteful things. Well, you already know that because the uh, man from Mississippi, he was doing commentary on trees. The reason why I know that you know that is because Allergic was in his comments and she was asking him to get in touch with her. And he said, I no longer do any type of commentary on trees. Well, from my understanding, uh, this individual 
uh, he was one of the ones that called CPS. So when I where, where I'm going, you 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 have to understand. You don't know but know how long these people has been embedded uh, with you know following her, following her distastefulness, and you never know who's watching you. With that being said, these people, I believe. Uh, are affiliated. I believe that they have been watching. I do believe that Callie has been one of the individuals uh, that I talk about that's an agent provocateur uh, that, that was watching um, so she could study, uh, 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 you know, another content creator movement. Um, at some point, they brought Alabama in. They brought Rita in. You had them try to infiltrate Keisha T. You had them then try to uh, they, 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 you know, uh, Rita was able to get information and do not forget about Bone on Bone. I want you to know that Bone on Bone played a very pivotal role in a lot of things that you are seeing as well. I'm going to go ahead and put you up. Uh, I warned you yesterday. Let me tell you something, bitch. If I say I'm going to put you up, bitch, I'm going to put you up. You commentary. Um, and you should have kept your motherfucking mouth closed because you don't know shit about me. Uh, only thing that you know is what the motherfuckers told you. You better go try to find that baby daddy, that that baby, that baby mama. Uh, Y'all have had a year and some change. You ain't found the bitch yet. You said that Bobby, he had a baby on the way. Uh, bitch, you need to get the busy. You need to get busy with your goddamn doxers. You and that goddamn blindy over there and say, let me holler at Bobby. Let me holler at Bobby and see if I can go ahead and get an interview with Bobby. So you and your crew, uh, you need to get busy. You, you, you've been slow with that thing. But anyway, Callie has been in this game for quite some time. Callie is a part of these goddamn motherfuckers. It don't matter how much she try to come out here and say that she's not a part of nobody. She was in this game by herself. Uh, she came in by herself. She telling the motherfucking lie. Uh, see, why? What, what you mean to tell me? They do that all didn't want to disrupt your live yesterday. Wait, see, what are you trying to tell me, Miss Dominic? I want to read your comment. They did that. Yeah, what you mean? Tell me they did that yesterday. You didn't want to uh, disrupt my live yesterday, Miss DJ. But oh yeah, people were checking her ch chat yesterday. We don't play about you, Miss DJ. Well, I don't give a fuck about Brittany. I don't give a fuck about it because I don't know her. She don't know me. You know, when a motherfucker come out here and tell you what DJ delusional and here we go, uh, uh, the case study, um, all this shit. Let me tell you something. The truth is the truth. And in order for you to do your due diligence, you got to know inside information. And a lot of the shit about Cali it came from is it came from leaks. It did. And when all that shit about CPS, all that shit was going on, I got a message. This is the God heaven truth. You know who you are. Hell, I don't know who you is, but you know who you are. They already had told me about this Britney. Uh, you know, they was bringing Britney in and all this shit here. You got to understand something. I'm not interested in none of that shit. I look at that shit. I keep it moving. That was not even a response to that message that I got because I don't give a fuck. The reason why I don't give a fuck, Dominic, you got to understand. I know how these people operate. You got to, uh, you, you know, two years you see the pattern. You know the recruiting. You know all the shit that they motherfucking do. And only time a bitch got to recruit somebody is because she needs some type of assistance. But I got the type of skill set. I know how to fire this bitch up in such a way that makes her goddamn realize that I'm not like the rest of these motherfuckers that you can pay off. I'm not a motherfucking agent provocateur. I'm not a part of your motherfucking coup. I'm not Rita. I'm not Cynthia Carver. I'm not none of these bitches. I don't give a fuck about your subscription. I don't give a fuck about if you leave. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Because when I go in, I'm going in regardless of what this, you see this mouth? You think this dilapidated tongue ass bitch, what can she do with this? She can't do shit with me. She can't do shit with me. That's the reason why they made the move that they made. When you see these content creators come out here and spin the goddamn narratives, they did all this shit around the meet and greet. They was plotting and planning. Let me slow it down for you. 
they was plotting and planning. When my channel got demonetized, let me tell you how I got, got good motherfucking allies. They had already let me know what was up. When I ended that live, when it was the day after, was probably two days after, I get a fucking message letting me know, you see all them goddamn uh, memberships? You see all the memberships. So let me give you a rundown, DJ. You got some people right now uh, became a member monitoring your motherfucking membership. So when it go pause, they can know that you have been officially demonetized. When I come out here and talk about certain shit, I'm talking about shit that's from within the inside shit that's going on on that back end. OK, this was prior to my page being this was when the page got demonetized on Real Talk with DJ, too. The page that you own right now. Only way that goddamn information came out is because of the motherfucking agent provocateurs, the motherfucking informants. You got to understand, they was plotting on my channel being demonetized, reporting my channel. This was, this was inside work that these motherfuckers was doing. But all because I don't give a fuck. They know I don't care. Fuck it. You ain't touching my main bread and butter. Fuck it, let's go. You want me to be like uh, uh, Pookie running around this bitch? Hey, 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 hey. I can't do that, baby. You will never see that happen. So you got to understand when these motherfuckers come out here and try to play like, oh, DJ, she delusional. No, bitch, the only thing delusional is you because you the one got to spin that motherfucking narrative that you and I both know is a motherfucking lie. That's the reason why they work so hard and I sit back and I laugh. Fuck you and fuck a membership too, bitch, because I don't give a fuck. I don't get, let me run it back to you one more motherfucking time. I don't give two fucks. When I come on this app, it don't matter if I'm monetized, demonetized, it's fucking up. I come to do my motherfucking commentary. And you have the right to tap the fuck out. Not in, but out. Okay? That's to your own discretion. Bitch, I ain't holding your motherfucking hand. I'm letting you know what it is. You ain't got to hear from a second, third, fourth, fifth party. I'm letting you know what's up. I'm letting you know some of these same motherfuckers that used to be on my channel, baby. The goddamn informants, the goddamn members, okay, of the motherfucking enterprise. These same goddamn bitches, you think they don't back Cali? You think they ain't with her? I talk about the agent fucking provocateurs. Don't play me. You ain't fucking with nobody that ain't goddamn booted and suited. Put them goddamn boots up, Cage. Uh, Candy Jones. They ain't fucking with nobody that's lightweight. Bitch, I'm heavy with it. I know that. That's the reason why you got the milli wop around this motherfucker like you do. You won't see no motherfuckers modding on my channel. You ain't modding no goddamn well. Go mod a dick, bitch. Because again, I'm not affiliated with you. I'm not fucking with you. So what do that mean when I talk about the saw that's bad? That mean that I don't give a fuck if I ain't never dem uh, uh, monetize on this bitch. I don't give a fuck. Let's roll. What pissed me off the most is how they play in our face gaslighting us like we didn't hear and see most of the shit DJ bring out. That's why they have deleted lies posts. Uh, they did that all around the uh, time of the meet and greet and what Callie did. See, I'm going to tell you something about Callie. Callie is the type of person when that shit went down with my channel, let me put your bitch ass up. Let the people know how regular your mouth is. You regular mouth ass, trick ass dog. All you motherfuckers got regular ass smiles. What you gonna do? What's up? You ain't gonna do shit. When Callie came out, look at that old mouth. Look at that old mouth, Enterprise. I done told you about getting it. You better get these bitches mouth fixed. When Callie came out and said, oh my God. DJ Page was demon. DJ Page's. They got rid of DJ. Now something not right. Now hey, Kelly, you was playing that role, motherfucker, because that's to keep you clear. That's to keep me off your back. You already knew that the pages was gonna be hit up. 
I just did not. I just told you a bone yesterday when I told your girl fees with knees, huh? Talk to me, motherfucker. I talk about the agent provocateurs. You think this is a goddamn game, don't you? Hey, bitch, you ain't got no motherfucking circle. You got a square. And that bitch didn't box you all the way in. So when they came out, they said, ha, 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 the plane is down. You had gump face goose saying, oh, my God, I feel something in the atmosphere tonight. You had Prince said, it's going down tonight. We got a dilapidated tongue, ass trick ass bitch. She going to goddamn put DJ down. How, Sway? Ain't none of these motherfuckers. They ain't built for it tough. What's up? Br bring your best. Bring your best, bitch. And you're still going to. You still going to fall. They came out here and said, oh, she's gone, guys. It's a, it's a celebration time. So what I did was I went live on IG. I, and people messaged me. I said, hey, I'll be back. At some point, I'll be back. Because I already knew that the pages was going to be reinstated. First page got reinstated was Real Talk with DJ2. I already knew what was up. Now, what these people did was, Kelly came out here. She said, that is just so bad what they did to DJ. You did that, but bitch, you already knew what was up. You already knew that they was coming after my ch channel. And let's be nice. Let's play in uh, DJ. Let me play in DJ face like I'm a goddamn ally. Bitch, you ain't no ally of mine. You ain't no ally of mine. You was the reason why they made the move that they made, bitch. How much money did they put up, Callie? You know I got to be a heavy motherfucking hitter, bitch. You had to bring out your best. You had to bring out your best, bitch. Then you had Eagle Eye, all the motherfucking turncoats, the agents. <laughs> they was in your chat talking about, I sent that to you. I told you what I did. What's up, Callie? What's up? What you hiding? All this shit that was done, motherfuckers tried to snake me. What makes you think I was confused, baffled over that whole move that was made when I'm already got motherfuckers telling me what type of shit, that, what type of time y'all was on? What's up with you? Bitch, didn't I tell you that you are, you are illiterate? You're dumb? You're stupid. You ain't skilled. Motherfucker, you ain't a thinker. I already knew what type of time these people was on. So she tried to play in my face. I went live on IG. I'll be back. Hold tight. I played the role to Kelly. The whole time I was being hit up and they was letting me know that you was a part of that whole shit, okay? Top row teeth, you uh, put a finger in between each tooth, bottom row on top of each other, Enterprise sent her to Mexico. It'll be cheaper or a dental school. No, she need to send her to Columbia. Somebody said they do good work in Columbia. Maybe they got somebody down there in Florida that can, they can recommend, you know? She don't give a fuck about her mouth. She can't afford to get her mouth fixed. Fuck that trick, bitch. That bitch don't give a fuck about her mouth. I don't think Kelly give a fuck about us coming out here telling motherfucking lies and swindling motherfuckers uh, with that with them scams. Cause she's a, she listen, Kelly. You you are a part of these people. Okay, you are part of these people. Let me go ahead and get into my commentary. You got to slow walk this bitch because she act like she don't understand. I asked you a question yesterday. Was you ever arrested? Had you ever been in the belly of the beast? Have you ever did time? I asked you that yesterday. I was hoping that you would come back live and hit that live like you like to do back to back to back. But you know not to play with me. You know where I'm going with this. You ain't stupid. The enterprise ain't stupid either. See, I'm going to tell you something. When all this shit came out with that scam, she was a part of it. Of course she was. Of course she was. You was a part of that scam. 
your same people that be in all these chats. Same people. Same people, Kelly. Same people. You remember the fake cake? <laughs> you old bitch. You a liar. You a liar. This came from your girl allergic. Raw squad and dog forever. Y'all motherfuckers been connected. You tried to come out here and play like you was looking for a Chad. You scammed those people. Then you dispersed that money out among your family members, the people that's connected to you with the fake ass pages and the troll pages. Oh, they paid agents. When y'all come up with good scams, you pay these people. Of course you give them something. You have to give them something so they can pump them goddamn fake pages and roam like they do. Oh, yeah, you do. This is what you motherfuckers do. When that scam happened, this was put in my chat. You see that, Callie? This is what you did. When that shit went down with the Holloway family, you was a part of that scam, too. You were so excited. The reason why you were so excited because uh, uh, the motherfucker said, hey, we got something now. We got something. What you got, Chad? We got Mr. We got the Holloway family. I'm going to go ahead and reach out to these people so I can get that money. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is get my people on board and see how much money we can come up with. You did that, bitch. You, you facilitated. You solicited that shit. And your, your supporters, they was on board because they didn't like Carver. So what they did was they came out. They started scamming. The Holloway family, who was a part of that scam, that trick mouth bitch over there with that dilapidated ass motherfucking tongue that ain't had, you bitch, ain't nothing came out that dry puss. Ain't nothing came out that dry puss but goddamn clots. That's bumble clot. Ain't nothing came out that motherfucker, even when, even if Dwayne was hitting something, only thing he was hitting, motherfucker, was clots. But ain't nothing came out of it because you ain't you can't produce nothing. You was a part of that family being scammed. And and and, and let me say this, people: the bitch couldn't have never did it without Maurice. The bitch could never have did it without Maurice. Maurice, who is Maurice? Chase. They had to come out here and scam that family. So, bitch, when you come out here and talk about you feeling some type of remorse, you ain't feeling no motherfucking remorse, bitch. You seen a money grab and all you motherfuckers took advantage of that money gram, money grab. All you trick bitches did because you in cahoots with each other. Check this out. Listen up. Came in my chat. Team 60 commitment. Circle entry gift equals 500 gift. Blessings. Payout. These motherfuckers, hey, that shit with uh, Layla, you got them your mouth. I told you that motherfucker, she is, she's a liar. But that motherfucker, she knows some mouth. Because that mouth, hey, that 63.5, that's goddamn an accurate, that could be an accurate number. With all the members that was in that goddamn terrorist squad. And bitch, let me tell you something. The only reason why you trick my ass motherfucking dog because I'm gonna be walking your motherfucking ass like you tried to walk them goddamn two miles. Bitch, I know I'm a heavy hitter because I'm gonna say, I wanna go, I wanna go, I wanna go. You tried to get your big ass up and walk them goddamn two miles, motherfucker, but you couldn't complete them. You trick ass goddamn dilapidated ass motherfucking bitch. You would've did anything to goddamn get rid of me. So what makes you think that you wasn't a goddamn part of all this shit as it relates to my motherfucking channels. You better go play with somebody that's willing to play with your uh, goofy goddamn ass. Daffy Duck. Now, let me say this. She was the first one 
to come out here and say that she was uh, wanting to find me. Mm. The Enterprise members, they told her to play, to play, to play, to play. The whole time, she already knew where I was. I see you just kicking it. She already knew what was what. Chad ran her the information. She posted it on her community wall. She's been catching hell ever since. Be careful what you want to find, bitch. You might find you might find what you're looking for, and you ain't been able to fuck around, and you fucked around and found out. Fuck you, trick, bitch. You seeing this number? 63,500. When you hear these content creators come on this bitch and talk about that she's never had a goddamn car, uh, uh, that was a, a functional goddamn car and she ain't never had shit. You better believe it because when she got that goddamn 63, five or how much money you motherfucking scam, that's when you was able to get you a motherfucking vehicle word on the street that your bitch ass couldn't even afford, afford motherfucking insurance for the goddamn uh, previous cars that you had. You trick Safeway ass motherfucking trick ass motherfucking dog head. No good. Trick ass motherfucking dilapidated ass tongue motherfucking trick bitch that couldn't goddamn produce no motherfucking human beings. That's the reason why you had to come out here and tell all these goddamn kind of lies. Bitch, I don't give a fuck who behind you, who beside you, who in front of you. What I'm telling you is, motherfucker, you will never be able to dapper down this goddamn truth. And let me say this to you fees with Cornelius. They said you were agent provocateur. Uh, that could be true because around the time that my page got goddamn taken, somebody said that you vanished like a thief in the night. Well, let me just say this to you, motherfucker. I don't give a fuck who with you, who a part of you, and if you vanished or not because, again, I have no emotional ties to these goddamn cocksuckers. It is, yes, it, it yes, yes. <laughs> I get off. Uh, a bit dog walking these goddamn trick bitches, okay? I can tell you that. I get off on that because they weak. They weak as hell. So when you see this uh, number here, I need you to understand uh, that 2,400, between 2,200 and 2,400 people was a part of that goddamn terrorist squad. I need you to understand that those 24, 2200 people that was a part of that goddamn squad. I needed you. To, I need you to understand that uh, those people were doxxed. Not only was they doxxed, I need you to understand that this goddamn cocksucker right here, she helped initiate that motherfucking scam. Who is that cocksucker? Let's go ahead and put this trick bitch up because you will always be a trick monkey mouth ass bitch over here at Real Talk with DJ. You see how that works? I dog walk all these goddamn Creflo dollar looking ass, trick ass, motherfucking weak ass, Todd puss ass bitches. You see that mouth right there? That is what you call a joker mouth. That joker mouth say, ooh, we, ooh, we got it. We can get some money. Let's go. I got all the information. I'll send that information back to the administrator, which is Chad and his people, and we'll goddamn get the boat rolling. They ain't going to fuck with us. They can do whatever they want to do. We can, hey, we're going to get this goddamn money. I am, I, I, I'm officially charged uh, uh, with these charges uh, in College Station. I am no longer working for Miss Misty. I was getting a thousand dollars a week and I'm broke, busted, and disgusted. Hell, me and Patches, we need something to smoke. So what did Rita do? Rita said, hey, no problem. I'll get the goddamn train up and running. So when you see all these bitches try to turn on that dilapidated tongue, bitch, understand a lot of them motherfuckers, they was with her. Not only was they with her, they was willing to walk the cross with that motherfucker. They said, oh, we got one now. The help is going to help us. You mean to tell me we got a motherfucker that can she just as vicious and she just as scandalous as, as we are oh yeah we got a good one let's roll and that's the reason why uh, uh, the, the, the fallout happened because the motherfucker didn't get what she was promised let's go here dog kids this is gonna be easy 
I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna slow walk them and just you get so much commentary on you motherfuckers, especially you, Kelly. You like the dog walk talking about you gonna dog walk somebody, bitch. You ain't gonna dog walk nobody with them goddamn claws, motherfucker. Cause I told you to leave me the fuck alone. I was not interested in you. I know that your life is dark, it's fucking gloomy. I know that you a trick dog. I know that you ain't got shit. I know that you never had shit. And the only reason why you come on this motherfucker acting like you had something because you ain't used to nothing okay that's what the fuck i said and i meant exactly what the fuck i said fuck you in the motherfucking womb that you come out of because guess what bitch it allegra she she's still alive and kicking she ain't dead either motherfucker and i'm gonna I, i'm really gonna run you in the ground with them obituaries that fake ass tombstone any motherfucking thing that you come out here and you put out here bitch i'm gonna use it against your motherfucking ass because bitch uh let britney know hey britney hey 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 motherfucker your girl is, she the case study. She the, hey, cold case, cold case, cold case got the bitch on the docket, Brittany. I just want to let you know. Hey, cold case got the bitch on the docket. It ain't a motherfucking trick, bitch, including yourself. You ain't going to be able to motherfucking do a goddamn thing about it. Uh, but take, take your seat and goddamn listen. And goddamn troll, because motherfucker, you motherfucking, you motherfucking trick, uh, weak ass, uh, bitches. Uh, Y'all better go get the help that you need. Now, where is this? I know I uploaded this shit. It's so much on this dog head. Well, let me run something to you, Callie. I thought I, I, I put it up. Did it upload? Look at that, talking about Dwayne, get your money. Of course, you, you told him to get his money because y'all had already, you had already holiday as people. All you motherfuckers wicked. You knew what was going on, you wicked ass trifling bitch. Look at Denise. Those beautiful teeth. Look at Denise. <laughs> hey. Denise Wayne. Hey. Denise be, Denise be wearing Big Mac out. I'm waiting on you motherfuckers to get Bobby. 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 Oh, Bobby. Bob, child, please. Now, let's go back here. Let me tell you how trifling these people is. Mm. <laughs> Rita <laughs> got paid $500. Okay. Darlene Stewart got paid $500. I'm going to tell you about the trichonology with these people. I thought I uploaded a, a screenshot, but I don't know worries. I'll, I'll, I'll circle the block and upload it at some point. Around November the 20th of 2022, Roz went on BX channel. Y'all remember BX Bronx. She went on her channel and she said that she was going to uh, get her her family was going to be helping her replace the money so she can refund the people. Never forget that she went from $400 to $500 per person, okay? When you seen Rita, Darlene Stewart, these people are what you call affiliates of the motherfucking enterprise. Whether you affiliate by trolling, whether you, because they got a lot of fake pages, people. Understand this. They fuck with bots and every goddamn thing else. Every time I think about these trick bitches, every time I think about what Gator said, he was 100% correct. Let's move on. Rita did not come in her name. She came in a different name. All of that was orchestrated. She she broke bread with with that bitch. She broke bread with that bitch. Is despite what she come out here and say and Rita this and Rita that and she went gonna do this. Rita just didn't get the amount that she was promised, but she did get something. And what she did was she came 
under another name, under another cash app, but all this shit in my strong, strong opinion, this was orchestrated, okay? This was orchestrated. Give the bitch something because the bitch did help dox all these people, including Carver, Carver, Mama, all the family, people, families and shit, myself, everybody that was in that goddamn uh, terrorist ass goddamn squad. You did this shit because you knew what was goddamn going down. When she come out here and try to play like she's oblivious, she don't know shit. She don't know what's going on. Her hands is clean, guys. I'm just a, I'm a, I'm a victim of these people. These people, these people. She's a part of these people. She's just as connected as she got them connected by the goddamn hip bone and the goddamn knee bone. And when you see me walk these trick bitches down like a goddamn dog that they are, it's because they are mutts. They are scamming ass mutts. When you see me talk about this trick, these trick bitches, hey, bitch, you ain't no better than Rita. I've said it before. I said it then. I've said it now. Who can scam the most? Both of you bitches running a tight ass race. Let's go here. Both of you trick bitches are scammers. And you running a tight ass race. Do y'all see this from someone that sent me this information? DJ, do you think all of them are knowingly playing each other so they can build their channels and get paid off of confusion? My response to this person, this was around the time of this goddamn scam and shit. Okay. My response, I said, pay attention. Majority of these jokers connected. And yes, they are knowingly playing each other to build channels. Listen, I watch Time and Moves, uh, Nay Nay, and others, just to name a few. Many of them been around. They just was incognito. I'm with you when you write. When you see the attacks on me for bringing out content and contesting the very thing that came out these trick bitches' mouths, they can't handle that. They want somebody that they can control that's part of their coup. Bitch, I'm uncontrollable. You can't fucking control me. This is the reason why I said uh, to Brittany, AKA slow tone. Let me tell you something. You dealing with some treacherous ass people. Uh, so much so, uh, Ocean, he put out this picture of allergic. Now, I don't know if this is allergic or not. He put out this picture of allergic. <laughs> Welcome to Real Talk with DJ. Mm hmm. Not long after Ocean put out that picture of allergic, uh, Ocean was experiencing his channel being demonetized. They were threatening to call CPS on Ocean. They said that he was uh, inappropriately uh, touching his daughter. Okay. Who was behind that? I can tell you, Callie, Chase, and others. Allergic was one of the ones that was also pumping that narrative as well. I need you to understand when you see this bitch come out here, they all got one thing in common. CPS. DCF calling government entities trying to get your children taken from you. One thing about these people, they have shown a pattern of behavior. 
let me let me read something to you what someone said around that time that shit went down. I've always told you that Cali go by fake aliases as well. Okay. She dabbed with fake aliases, just like Chad and the rest of them goddamn enterprise members that have something to hide. Okay. Check this out. When she lied and said she was a social worker and she's not, she knows somebody that's a social worker. Okay. She came out here among us all and said that she was a mandated reporter. She said that she was a social worker. Listen to this person. When she lied and said she was a social worker and she and she's not, she knows somebody that's a social worker that's a part of the enterprise. That's why she have them call on people who's getting in her way. They know the burbage to call the authorities on people to get them in trouble with children services. Services. She did it to the late Ocean TV. Trees and more. Okay. Let's not forget about shun the thoughts, fucked up thoughts. She's another individual. Uh, that they had uh, said that she doxed, allergic to BS. Uh, so fucked up thoughts. Your name was out there too. Can't forget about you, trick bitch. Let's go here. Allergic to BS had a fetish as it relates to CPS. DCF, the man from Mississippi, he had a fetish calling DCF, calling CPS. You do your due diligence, it's going to lead you to Mississippi, Louisiana, Chicago, and Texas. We can't forget about Detroit. New York, just to name a few. When this shit went down, allergic to BS per lot lizard legend, he said that allergic had a operation all by herself. And I do believe the reason why she said Ron squad so forever, don't forever, because whatever operation that she was uh, running, entangled in, that involved trees. That involved uh, content creators coming in the game, uh, getting channels, uh, doing a commentary on a poor pissed mother. Okay? <laughs> I need you to understand that Ross. She was, she played a pivotal role in that, okay? I want you to know that uh, allergic to BS was very, very adamant about her shit. She said, um, DJ, you goddamn, you on meth, you in, a, you in the projects? Ah, I said, goddamn, allergic. Ah, hey, hey, turn that camera around. I want a 360 view. Shit, you fuck that. Don't don't tease me, baby. Turn the camera around. You in the goddamn projects? Ah, you on fucking mouth? I need you to understand that all these motherfucking players, including that trick mouth bitch, Ross, <laughs> Callie, all these motherfuckers played a role in that shit. When she said it's dog forever, don't make no mistake about it. Callie know exactly who Chase is. Chase know who exactly Callie is. When you seen all this goddamn scamming 
that's going on with the motherfucking enterprise. I need you to understand that everybody have played a pivotal role. One thing a person told me, they said, hey, DJ, uh, <laughs> Chad and L, Chad gets a cut. God damn, a cut. A cut. Whew. You at the top, baby. Oh, okay. You get a cut. You get a cut for every goddamn scam. Uh, you able to you you able to get off the ground? Hmm, that makes sense. Look at look, 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 look. Raw squad and dog sisters forever. She meant every word. So when you uh do commentary on me, Brittany. And you think I'm coming out here halfway. And you think you're being ran in circles like the merry-go-round. No, trick, bitch. I'm touching the motherfucking surface. And see, they like to get window dummies like you. That, that ain't did your goddamn homework. That they can come out here and mind fuck you and win me you. Ain't hey, hey, motherfucker. It may look like trick, bitch, but it's heavy. It's heavy, bitch. So I need you to understand when you got them doing commentary on me. Hey, baby, I'm booted and suited. I know more shit, bitch, than you will ever motherfucking know. And since I and, and all because I won't go along with these trick bitches, because I would never, I would never fuck with them. It's up and it's stuck over here, this motherfucker. And I don't give a fuck how many people you recruit, bitch. I'm coming to you today and letting you know every motherfucker around you, bitch, weak. Fuck them foot soldiers. Them wanna be a uh, foot ass, uh, trick ass motherfucking bitches. Don't you ever think you gonna put my motherfucking name in your goddamn mouth and it ain't gonna be no motherfucking response? Fuck you. You better go play with the. Uh, you better go play with them goddamn DCF and, and CPS workers. Cause they can't call no goddamn CPS on me. Cause uh, if I had a, let me, tell, let, me tell, let me tell you something, motherfucker. They think this a game. Motherfucker told me, DJ, if if, 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 if Kaya was a, 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 a not a, over eighteen, these bitches will be weighing you out with CPS. I said, they can wear me out with CPS, but they, they wouldn't go no farther. <clears throat> they wouldn't get my motherfucking child. You goddamn children snatch, uh, snatchers. Fuck you, bitch. But you fuck with me, you go, you'll get some lead up in you. I tell a goddamn judge, bitch, I'll lay my life down. I'll lay, it, I'll lay my life down for my motherfucker child. Bitch, I, hey, hey, when you put that pistol up, bitch, you ain't the only one got, uh, uh, goddamn got no Glock. You ain't the only motherfucker running around here making sure they family is safe, fucking with these trick ass bitches. I'm not playing with them. Everything that I'm telling you, I didn't put it in the police report. I'm not playing with these goddamn bitches. They think it's a motherfucking game. They coming on here talking about entertainment. It ain't no motherfucking entertainment. I'm telling you what these trick ass bitches would do if I had a motherfucking child that was under 18. They'll be calling CPS on me. So what you think they'll do for you? They'll play you, use commentary against you at the same motherfucking time and be smiling in your motherfucking face because they skeezers. 
And I just got the testicular fortitude to come out here and meet these motherfuckers where they are and tell them, hey, baby, hey, baby, you ain't you ain't did nothing. You ain't did shit. You can't even move the needle. You dealing with dope fiends. You dealing with motherfucker peel poppers. You dealing with liars. You dealing with tricks. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me do this and, and get up out of here. Let me go back to you. This is what Ocean put out. This is what Ocean put out. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you the reason why I know Ocean was a target and the reason why they started moving in on Ocean in, in, in India. She folded like a trick bitch because she's scared of these motherfuckers. Either, either, you, either you scared of them, you fear them, or are you a part of them. You got to pick one, bitch. Nobody came out to that brother and said, hey, don't forget about true story. Okay. She was fucking with Ocean around that time. Joker mouth, toxic tea. All these motherfuckers was players that was brought in. They brought toxic in too. When all that shit went down, not one time did they come out here and say, Ocean, I'm going to get your channel back. And that lets you know how dirty and scandalous these motherfuckers are. They'll play in your face. I've had many play in mine. But they couldn't touch me. Let me run it back to you one more time. The same way they played Ocean, I had many play in mine, my face as well, agent provocateurs, but they couldn't fuck with me. They couldn't get what they needed. They couldn't get close to me. They turned around and used that brother. But see, that brother had a lot of uh, 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 videos, behind the scenes, recorded conversations. When you see these people running around talking about, oh, oh, uh, he was a good person. And you see that information that was dropped in Callie's chat when he expired. Who dropped it in her, her chat? I think it was that other Shalanda. Who they claim they was beefing. Rita was beefing with. Now all of a sudden they didn't teamed up together. I'm trying to tell you the trickonology and what these trick bitches are do. These are scandalous ass bitches. These are type of motherfucking bitches that are smile in your face and stab you in the back at the same time if the if it come down to that money. But you didn't see none of these trick ass bitches coming to ocean motherfucking aid. But how was they privy of his expiration? Huh? They had it out for that brother. They had it out for ocean. Let's call CPS. I just read to you one of the things that they said that this trick bitch uh, dab into with your rainbow collision ass with that goddamn rainbow in that back of that goddamn car seat that day. And, and, and you went live with that goddamn rainbow coalition, bitch. It makes sense what Dwayne said, motherfucker. You could be over there uh, 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 flapping. You could be over there flapping, bitch. He did say that you uh wanted to go into a gay club. You want to take a heterosexual ass man in a goddamn gay club. You see this 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 right here. This rainbow coalition, coalition, bitch. You better you hey hey motherfucker. You better pipe the fuck down and lay down. With your pancake popping ass. Uh, she probably into women. 
She ain't over there fucking and getting stuff. She ain't over there. Fuck Woody ain't fucking her. She ain't fucking nothing. She probably over there uh, 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 tapping, ta uh, 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 flapping, flapping, flapping ussy. She probably a ussy eater. And you over here trying to make it seem like I'm a butch bitch. I got laid real good. I got, <laughs> bitch, I got laid real good over the weekend, bitch. And I guarantee you, motherfucker, I was, it, it wasn't no goddamn, it was a good Peter, motherfucker. And and, 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 and that makes sense what Dwayne said. I believe Rambo. Shout out to Rambo. You old Rainbow Coalition, motherfucker. Talking about you goddamn Woody. Woody ain't fucking you. You ain't fucking shit. You, 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 in my opinion, bitch, you in them, them goddamn women. But we going to get there. Now, shout out to Denise. Shout out to Denise and Big Mac. Big Mac ain't never goddamn coming back. Big Mac can't satisfy a motherfucker that wants some coot knot. <laughs> she, she want coot knot. She don't want no motherfucking Peter. You ain't got no business taking no man, no heterosexual man, to no motherfucking gay club unless that's what you're into. That's what you're into, you trick ass motherfucking rainbow collision ass bitch. You, you gonna learn, motherfucker, to keep my name out your trick ass motherfucking mouth. I'll dog your ass on these YouTube streets. I'll dog you, and I know I can dog you. So I don't even know why you even think that you a goddamn challenge for me and any of the motherfuckers that's behind you, bitch. I'll dog your trick ass. You goddamn lot lizard number two, dilapidated ass, tongue ass, motherfucking duck mouth ass rooster. Fuck you, trick. DJ, the problem is you address the scams and bullshit while they focus on attacking families and children and the deceased keep bringing the fire the money is drying up and i ain't got to come out here and talk about this bitch's health because i'm not gonna do it i ain't got to come out here talking about her deceased uh uh a uh, 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 motherfucker that she didn't have i'm not gonna do it that boy i don't know that boy He's innocent. He's deceased. I am not that motherfucking low. I don't have to come out here and talk about somebody's health. I don't have to come out here and talk about somebody deceased motherfucking uh, fa uh, family member, somebody that you didn't motherfucking pu push out your puss. Because again, you is too motherfucking illiterate rainbow because we all know blondie is part of the community and that's the reason why Dwayne said what he said damn it he said that uh, she tried to take him to a, a gay club what heterosexual woman ask, ask that question what heterosexual woman unless you into those things would go to a Gay club. The Dwayne went lying and said what she did was she tried. And, and, and this goes back to what Cat Williams was saying. It makes sense. See, 2024 is a is a is is it's a it's a year of exposure. See what the truth does is they sit back and they say, "Oh, it's a lie," because see what what it does is you 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 cutting beneath the belt, and see they can't take it. So the first thing they say is she crazy, she deranged, she's delusional. No trick, bitch. That's what these motherfuckers, that's they go to. Oh, she's crazy. Don't listen to her. Bitch, I didn't tell them to motherfucking come over here and listen. I wouldn't give a fuck if it's 10. I'm still going to get my shit off. Games. The same way Maurice is part of the community. Bitch, you part of the community too. And hell no, you ain't had no children. Hell no, you ain't pumped out nothing. You put out different pictures as it relates to 
Manny Lou Thomas, but Manny Lou Thomas was in the belly of the beast. The only thing that you have did is resurfaced the shit that was laying dormant. You didn't open up a can of worms. That's what you did by running off at your mouth. And don't say that I don't have it because yes, I did. Because it's I'm, 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 I'm gonna get you, Cali. Let me tell you the real, let me tell you the way I'm gonna get you. Because see, when you came out here and you put certain things out, I'm gonna go by what you didn't put out and then go from there. We're gonna we're gonna do Maddie Lou. We know that she was arrested. We know that she was in the belly of the beast. You came out here putting pictures out. You said that was Maddie Lou. We'll get to see her in real time. See, 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 motherfucker, you, what you need to do is go back to your board, you and your board members, uh, Callie. You better revise. You better think it over because I'm not a part of you. Anytime a motherfucker's not a part of you, you it's open game, okay? I don't have no allegiance to you. I'm not connected to you. I don't have no alliance with these motherfuckers. I don't have no alliance with none of you trick bitches. What woman of confidence have to bring strippers into their home they share with their children? When I tell you, you don't never know what these people was into. They could have been into uh, some explicit shit. I, 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 I opened up and I said, I believe these people. Had, ain't no telling what they've been into. Ain't no telling. It's something that I would never expose my child to. Okay. But she was a part of that. So when she come out here and say she's a good mother, bitch, you ain't good with shit. You you, you good with calling the goddamn 911. Have no motherfucking panic attacks. Because like I say, motherfucker, you, you, bitch, you probably been up all night long. Pacing. Pacing. Nervous as a motherfucker. Cause that's what you, that's what happens when you come out and tell lies. See, you didn't never, you never thought this was going to come. Bitch, it ain't nothing that you can do to me. Bitch, it's not nothing that you can attack. It's not nothing that you can motherfucking do to me. You ain't stopping my money. You can't do shit, bitch. I, I, bitch, let me tell you something. About a year ago, when you motherfuckers start displaying all that fuck shit, I start immediately getting documentation. To show how you motherfuckers roll. I don't know these goddamn criminals. These are internet thugs. They got hate groups. Uh, they hide behind fake aliases, fake names. They are the motherfucking criminal enterprise. They are tapping into government entities, government uh, 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 fucking officials that is tapping into bad ethical practices that they engage in. These motherfuckers are hermits. They turn around and they try to use intimidation tactics. Bitch, you can't Get, hey, hey, motherfucker, you ain't been successful yet. You ain't been successful yet. Now, let's go here. Y'all seen this. It was some more shit I had it didn't upload. Do y'all remember Kia Love? <clears throat> Kia Love, DJ riding on a transparency of confidence. Roll, baby girl, always. Let me say this here about uh, Kia Love. Mm. We all know that Kia Love is a troll. Kia Love is what you call an agent provocateur. Around March of 2022 or 2023, okay? Kia Love said, this is what was said to me. Hey, DJ, read Kia Love in the chat. She explained why she went in Chad inbox. She said she was blocked. Something about Chad had her son pick up. She explained this in Rita's chat. You do see Kia Love. Kia Love is one of these goddamn trolls. She's been over here, but the bitch is blocked over here. But she's been in Rita's chat because she's she's active in that motherfucking chat. Check this out. Kia Love <coughs> said, and I'm just giving you context. Kia Love said Ross scammed her sister. 
So she on Ron's ass. Now she has put in Rita's chat that she will be at the meet and greet. Her son's father lives in Vegas and she will be there. When I come out here and talk about these people knowing that this bitch is a known scammer, she is. Feast with Kernese on 4 2023. We got screenshots of Feast with Kernese. She's active in Rita's chat. <clears throat> That's the reason why I said that Fees with Kernese, she's another individual that I believe has multiple channels, multiple fake pages. Uh, these people, they hop from Rita's chat to Callie's chat. What am I telling you at this point? I'm talking about infiltration. I'm talking about agent provocateurs. I'm talking about people that fake beef. I'm talking about think people that goddamn go from chat to chat. Now, check this out. Fees with Kernese, around this time, Callie was doing commentary, going back and forth, like you see right now, with her in that trick mouth, doll face ass motherfucking bitch that is going to motherfucking prison. Fees with Kernes, she bounced back and forth, back and forth, chat to chat, chat to chat, screenshot, screen recordings. <clears throat> okay? So when you hear these people come out this motherfucker and talk about they uh, uh, do not get along with Born Yard Betty. They don't give a fuck about Born Yard Betty. Born Yard Betty, Born Yard Betty. I need you to understand the roles that these fake pages, these trolls, the roles that the enterprise play. Fees with Kernese is a agent provocateur. Fees with Kernes is a Raw Squad member. She's a Raw Squad supporter. Okay? When you see all of this shit, and if you confuse why I say what I say on my channel, that's mine, not yours, about these goddamn agents, these liars, these tricks that play both sides. I'm not saying it just to be saying it. I'm saying because there's proof to back up what I'm saying. You heard Lucinda, Treese, talk about the fake pages. Talk about what the uh, the requirements are to be a part of their group. One of them is you got to have, you got to at least make, what, 30 pages? What I'm telling you, it's not something that's just made up. It's been talked about behind the scenes. It's been discussed behind the scenes. I have, I have, if I'm, if I'm sent something, if I'm sent something, I can come back and say, hey, you know, I may say, well, well you know, uh, you know, well, 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 you see this shit here? Well, we can see that on these YouTube streets to, to support that goddamn t message. So fuck these people that come out here and say, uh, cold, cold case, uh, DJ, you damn right. I said I was going to put that trick bitch up because she had no motherfucking business with my fucking name in her motherfucking mouth. I ain't got no reason to come out here and lie to you motherfuckers. You ain't paying my motherfucking bills. You ain't, hey, hey, it's all going to be due within a couple of days, motherfucker. You ain't paying my motherfucking uh, 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 bills over this bitch. I talk about what the fuck I want to talk about. Fuck you. You don't run shit over here, this motherfucker. You think I'm just talking to be talking when, I, when I'm telling you that these people are motherfucking agents? They play both sides to survive? That bitch need content? You can't even talk about the other trick no good because goddamn tr trees, motherfucker, because... Again, Born Yard Betty is your motherfucking content, which, uh, like I said, bitch, do what you do. I can't run your channel. Bitch, you can make me your content all I care. I don't give a fuck. 
gold no not the world traveler who speaks who spends time in europe the amazing husband sister who runs her page and independently wealthy now i i hey 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 I wouldn't lie to you. I thought I uploaded it. Somebody, like I said, had already told me, they said, fees with Kinesis are agent provocative. You know, I said, well, let me go back into them goddamn archives and I'll be damned. Fees with Kinesis. Fees with Kinesis. She's not by herself. I can't single you out, motherfucker, because you ain't by yourself, but I'll be damned. You know who sent this to me. You know who you are. Hell, I ain't going to call y'all. I, I got your shit blotted out so they can't goddamn know who you is. But this is what I was told, people. And I believe this person. I believe you. Okay? And in my strong opinion, when you see these meet and greets and shit, so I'm gonna tell you something about these people that's pumping these this money to these motherfuckers. They have studied these people and they realize that these motherfuckers is broke, busted, and disgusted. And they'll do anything, some of them, not like it used to be. They'll do anything to try to protect this goddamn dilapidated ass motherfucking dog head, trick ass motherfucking bitch that mouth. Well, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Mouth hanging. And the only reason why they try to do that is because they know, bitch, you got a lot of dirty secrets. You got a lot of dirty secrets. You got a lot of dirty secrets. You got a, you got a, you got so much dirty laundry. They're so consistent to everything that I've witnessed in these YouTube streets. The poor piss mammy. You got your girl over there. <clears throat> she over there working, trying to change directions. But bitch, you didn't been left behind like the wizards, the fucking wizard number three that you are. Cause it's another one. It's a number two. You number three. Chase number two. You got lot lizard. You got the wizard number two, and you the wizard number motherfucking three. Somebody somewhere. Somebody somewhere. They know everything that I'm saying, dog. Here, they know it's truth behind it. You are scandalous, low down, dirty, conniving, deceitful, bitch. In this fetish. This obsession that y'all have with CPS. You got children in this sector? You fucking with these people? You better be careful. And, and what I'm saying, don't take it lightly. I'm dead damn serious. When that person left me that message... Y'all may hear my fan. I got my fan by my desktop. Kerniz is a big payer and indeed a recorder, recorder, the enterprise. Absolutely. Her name has been ringing uh, for quite some time, especially ever since when my channel got um, uh, demonetized. That's when her name started ringing. But her name was also brought up again in April of 2023. Now, check this out. She's a big player. Yeah. Check this out. I, I can't. I, and this motherfucker here is smart as hell. This motherfucker right here ain't light, baby. When she lied and said she was a social worker. And she's not. She knows somebody that's a social worker. Do y'all remember when I said that there was a Roslyn? 
that had facilities, group homes, to my three bush wash watchers that's in the bushes. We're going to get back in the murky waters. I, I want to revisit. Uh, I know that you're not active in my chat. Stay your ass in this skybox. I want to go back. I don't need to go back. It's something that has been missed. I know I have it. If I don't have it, I know you have it. But um, this was, if I'm not mistaken, I had put out something in the context of somebody that was found that was a, that was that may be in New York. We 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 gonna find out. I know I can. I know I got the paperwork, but I just want to make sure um, because you want to play. You want to play. You want to play, Callie. Let me, let, let me put Callie up. This is how you got to do it. You ain't got to. You ain't all that talking about health and all that shit. No, baby. We don't. I don't do that over here. What you do with this bitch? You got to. You come with the truth. <laughs> You know, you come, you, 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 you got the hit. You when you hit, you got the hit with facts. You don't, you don't come with, oh, I'm talking about you. Uh-uh. That motherfucker immune to that. I don't even get down like that. I like to get down to the nitty-gritty. You know what I'm saying? If you got motherfucking players that's connected to entities, I wanna, I wanna get down with the get down to the point where we start. You know, go ahead and file your legal papers and do what you do when you say you got motherfucking people on your side that's legally astute. So do I got a motherfucker as well. Let's go. What's up? You know I ain't scared. Now, check this out. When she lied and said she was a social worker, and she's not. She knows somebody that's a social worker that's a part of the enterprise. That's why she have them call on people who's getting in her way. If you have been had, if you have experienced anybody calling CPS on you. Reporting you, you can link that back to this goddamn cocksucker, Chad, and the motherfucking enterprise because this is the way they get down. Let me go ahead and run it back to you one more time because I'm going to tell you something. I'm not playing no games. Okay? If you have had any CPS called on you, any reportings of CPS, DCF? You see this cocksucker right here? You can link it back to her and the motherfucking Enterprise and Chad and the rest of the motherfuckers. This person is telling me shit that we found out in real time. Houseway. Make it make sense. Who's delusional? Because see, Kelly, the goal has always to force you to the point where you feel like when you talk about you got people backing you. I've came out here and said that you're not who you say you. I've made a lot of claims about you. And you still come out here, you oh that trick bitch, she ain't got nothing. Oh, that trick bitch, she does and she didn't. Because see, motherfucker, hear me today. You ain't never ever experienced no motherfucker like me before, and you can't handle me. You are no motherfuckers that's backing you. She knows. Somebody that's a social worker, that's a part of the enterprise. That's why she have them call on people who's getting in her way. Have we seen these people in the sector? Have we seen CPS, DCF be called on people in this sector? Yes, we have. Yes, we have. 
They know the verbiage. Pause. They know the verbiage. The only way that you're going to know the verbiage is because you're familiar with the process. Welcome to Real Talk with DJ. Thank you so much for joining me. Please make sure you hit the like button. The reason why you know the verbiage, the language to use is because you're familiar with the motherfucking process. What's up, Cordy? Are you up yet? What time it is on the on the West Coast? I hope you had your coffee this morning, big nose, Cordy. Now, let me say this here. She knows the verbiage. It's not that she knows the verbiage. It's the people that she's connected to. They know the language and the verbiage because they are a part of the mother fucking system that try to that have act you know get people's children check this out she's the fucking house manager they know the verbiage to call the authorities on people to get them in trouble with children's services she did it to ocean the yes yeah, she did it to ocean these motherfuckers uh, let me tell you something this shit, this shit. I got to come up out this shit today. But I'm going to tell you something, you dilapidated tongue motherfucker. You dilapidated tongue much big trick bitch. You, I wish to God, I said, Lord, somebody please don't, bitch, don't please, because when I get started, it's hard for me to stop. Okay. See, what she did, atonement moments. DJ, I knew that was a tall tale when she said social workers, social workers take oaths and in intentional defamation is forbidden. The oath includes the well-being of all. Again, you never know who's here. I can tell you that I got some motherfuckers in my bushes and they, they, they stop us. <laughs> Being a house manager, and foster care person she was exposed to sws well let me say this here is it sharon i think it's sharon uh one of them thomas's they are a uh, foster care mother if i'm not mistaken i want to say it is the one that's dark skinned with the limp that could be, is it Sharon or is it, might be Elaine. It might be Elaine. Elaine uh, Dotson, social worker. Okay, I got you. Elaine Dotson, that's who may be the one with the limp. Now, I, I, I can't. Uh, confirm this yet, but I'm going to go back. Hey, 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 I know you in my bushes, but I believe that don't, uh, uh, Elaine, Elaine may be the one that is a social worker and um, the dark skin with the limp. That may be Elaine. She is a social, I mean, not a social worker, but a foster care parent. Okay. So, yes. I think it's Elaine. Not sure, but I think it's the dark skin one. Yeah. Uh, being a house manager and foster care person, she was exposed to uh, social workers. Not only was she exposed to so social workers, uh, she they they they, uh, they take people's identities uh, and they use other people's information as if it's their own. Okay, and 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 that's the reason why she was able to get away with all this bullshit about trying to uh, help a motherfucking mother, but ask that bitch where's her motherfucking credentials as it relates to her being a fucking social worker. And that house that she's in with that trust, and when she come out here and she said that she was a homeowner, the only reason why she did that was because she thought that nobody was going to research her, nobody was going to go back behind them. That's the reason why she did that, because they, she lied. 
because she's a fucking liar. You dealing with a fucking narcissist, uh, a fucking uh, scammer, a trick mouth, lying ass, hoover boy looking fucking bitch. And she would do anything just like Chase and Chad for that dollar. Unplug your computer, DJ. Them Dotsons, you back in the 601. Get out of Mississippi. You going too deep. Well, hey, I don't know. Uh, I may have to <laughs> I may have to get up out them waters, atonement moments. What you think? I don't know. You tell me, David. They call me delusional. You know, I, I don't know nothing. I don't know what you've been told. I don't know. I don't film. I ain't got no fear of you. You little cocksuckers. I call them all kind of goddamn cocksuckers and motherfucking uh, frog face bitches. I call them all kind of fucking names and what they gonna do about it? Nothing. So I'm about to go. Thank you for joining me. It's 9.29 a.m. Y'all make sure y'all have a blessed day. Uh, commentary on Cali will indeed increase. A commentary on this goddamn cocksucker right here. Let me go ahead and put you up, cocksucker. I bet you said, whoo, that motherfucker ain't talked about me much this morning. Oh, no, Rita. We can't leave you out. We can't leave you out, Rita. You gonna be forever commentary until you walk in them doors, Rita. Let's go ahead and put you up. You think you you think you didn't got away, motherfucker. You ain't got away. You still up. Uh, I need y'all to understand uh, that when these trick bitches come out here and talk about they are needing money for a food truck, uh, just know uh, as long as she give uh, commentary, give uh, Cali commentary, uh, I'm will I'm I believe that the enterprise is willing to donate to her. Uh, fake ass fraudulent charity okay let me run it back to you one more time uh as long as she come out here she's not monetized uh she's not working for free people okay i believe that the reward this is the reason why she said well fuck it how am i gonna get this money let me go up here and get me a motherfucking donation i need charity uh we'll donate to you we'll give to you but you're gonna have to first Set it up where it looked like a, it's a charity so we can, it looked like it's legit, you know? Because, hey, Rita, you and that trick my ass goddamn patches. <laughs> hey, bitch, you ain't, like you said, bitch, you ain't doing nothing for free. So uh, when you see this bitch come out here talking about she need a food truck, understand it's all a scam. Uh, understand that these people like Quinn Quinn, uh, Grub Grub, <laughs> Tell Hera I said, what's up? He from the south side of Chicago. Tell Hera I said, what's up? Or we going to put him up. What's up, Hera? What's up? <laughs> what's up, motherfucker? Tell, I, tell Hera I said, <laughs> What's up, Queen Queen? You think it's a game, motherfucker? You think it was? You 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 thought you really thought it was a game? Let's see if we can get somebody to get DJ. Now this shit is not fucking right. Her coming out here and she got damn think she gonna fucking export damn fucking Cali. We ain't gonna fucking take this bullshit. Well, fuck you, trick bitch. You gonna do what? Hey, it's my motherfucking channel. And the last I checked, bitches said my name. And motherfucker. Fuck you, fuck your money, fuck the enterprise, and fuck the members. It's a go, bitch. A fo 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 go. Now, uh, check <laughs> check this out, Rita. Uh, now we gonna give to you. We gonna give. <laughs> we gonna give to you. But you can't damn come out here any kind of way. Put that damn charity up, damn it. Well, damn, what can I think of? Let me think of a food truck. You know today I can feed the homeless. I can give them uh, some damn, uh, uh, what, what did she say? Let's, let, let, let's go here. That bitch said that she can give them a warm place to stay. She can do all that. Oh, that's up Queen Queen Alley. That's up her alley. Bitch, you ain't coming out here hitting that live for nothing, motherfucker. They paying you, Rita. They paying you. They paying you, Rita. Why is you, why, hey, how you gonna play a player? 
How you going to play a skilled motherfucker? They paying you. That's why you came out here. It's a hustle, hustle, hustle. That's why she said, hold on. I'll hit that motherfucking live. I'll hit that live and give uh give D Daffy Duck some goddamn content if they going to bless me. Wake up, people. Wake up. That song by R. Kelly, Wake Up Everybody, Wake Up. This is the Wake Up channel. When I ain't on this motherfucker, they be happy as hell. I, I'm so happy. I'm so happy she ain't came on the day. Hello? Put that, keep that mutt, keep that, keep that motherfucker in that hole. But when I step on the scene, when I step on the scene and I put out that fucking the facts, Jack, you motherfuckers got to work like Hebrew slaves. Because, see, you mad because I see your hand. You mad because, see, I see through the bullshit. You mad because, see, you weren't able to get a motherfucker like me. We want you, DJ, bitch. You don't want nothing. You better go pray. You better go, hey, my soul, hey, hey, baby. If I lose it all, if, hey, motherfucker, one thing about it, I'll never be in cahoots with you bitches. I know it touch your soul. I know it fuck with, you, fuck with your ego. Because you can't take it. You like them Coonettas like Rita. You like them Coonettas like Carver. Bitch, I'll never be. Bitch. Baby, everybody in the Arthur Dunn's office is watching me holler. Let me say this here. These motherfuckers keep a damn, keep, they keep, keep a damn justly. Mm. A just in case. I'm gone, y'all. Until next time, stay woke. The only people mad is the motherfuckers that's a part of this whole coop. Never forget that when I talk about these dog heads, I do it in such a way, I don't feel nothing. I don't feel nothing. I ain't had to talk about nobody that's deceased. I ain't had to talk about nobody motherfucking health. I was able to come out here, get my shit off, and I'm out the door. It's that plain and simple. Never forget what Ocean said. This was his thumbnail. Calm over chaos. Devil's sector. They was all, including this bitch right here, these two motherfuckers right here, Lot Lizard, Chad. I don't know if Rita played a role in Ocean. I, I can't. I can't make that call. I ain't gonna tell no lie on nobody. If I don't have facts to back it up, but this, these two motherfuckers right here, Lot Lizard, Chase, Callie, Treese, allergic. They wanted him gone. And when 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 Lot, when Lot Lizard came out here and said that he wanted Ocean to have but a certain amount of time, I don't know what that was about. But what I will tell you, that these people are vicious. And make no mistake about it, they are called CPS. DCF, because like the person said, they know the verbiage. They know the verbiage. They know the verbiage. They know the language. They know the process. The same way Quinn Quinn know about the process. 
the ins and outs as it relates to the charities. When she came on my panel, <laughs> hey, you couldn't handle it. You go, you go, you go. Bye bye. She came on my channel and she basically told me that she was a part of the charities, the charity groups. How soon do we forget? She's very astute. She knows the language. She knows the process. They know how to get money. And the question should always be in our minds is why would you want to give a, a car payment money to a dusty, rusty motherfucker that you claim was antagonizing you, harassing you? You said that you was uh, uh, dying. Y'all attacked that channel so there would be no trace of evidence, but there is a screen recording. So when you see these people spinning narratives, when you see these people come out here and talk about, oh, that's delusional, that's crazy, that's the case, that's, that's, uh, that's, that, that's, that's the case, study. that's the cold case. Fuck you. Fuck you. And the only reason why they try to attack channels is because they want to erase evidence. So it can be non-existent to the eye. So you can forget about what they have done. Because this is how they operate. But see, understand something. The same way that they, they, uh, 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 allergic used to come out here and claim, oh, I, I, we going to call DCF and all this shit. That's the same pattern that this trick bitch right here has dabbed in. They dab in that shit. They know, they know the verbiage because they connected to someone that's in these agencies that dab with that shit. And only people out here that's being, uh, acting like they dumb and oblivious is what's going on is the agent provocateurs. Listen, bitch, I'm not trying to reach you, motherfuckers. That's not the goal. When I come on here, I'm doing response, reactions to the shit uh, that has been put out. So when you see these trick bitches not coming out here with readers' paperwork, because I'm going to come out with, with it. When you see these bitches coming out, not tell, they talking about her. Let me, let me tell you something. Now. Let me tell you something. It goes back to what I said about fees with Kinesis, these goddamn agent provocateurs. When you see these people, not talking about the real shit. I need you to understand it's because they have been paid to shut the fuck up. You ain't gonna rat out. You ain't gonna expose your own. Because these hate groups, these goddamn Groups that they have formulated. You're not going to expose your own. You're not going to do it. They have proven this. When they set up and, and, and talked about ocean, oh, our ocean is gone. Bitch, you didn't give a fuck about ocean. You was part of the narrative that was being pumped about his, 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 his child. But they say that his wife was a pillar in her community. So when I say these people are vicious, 
they scandalous, they treacherous, they are used people for their personal gain, for their own personal agenda. But when you resist it and you don't feed into their ideology, when you don't feed into their fake gas narratives and you don't go along with the go along, you become a motherfucking delusional person like Real Talk with DJ. You can say whatever you want to say about me, motherfucker. Last time I checked. It's not what they call you. It's what you answer to, bitch. And I don't answer to nothing that you motherfuckers call me. If you in your feelings, that's on you. That's on you. That ain't got nothing to do with me. They all scammers. They all liars. Counting money that you got from innocent people. Making false promises. Filtering the money out to the people that's connected to you. But one thing this trick dog will never tell you is that even though her and Rita had that falling out or whatever went down, she was privy to that information. That Rita, she knew what Rita was doing in that goddamn circle. She knew that Rita was getting people's information. Her and Chad, they was all working together, people. Gator was right premeditated scams. This disgusting shit that you see right here, counting money, is one of the most filthiest shit that I've ever seen. It's tacky. These bitches are tacky. When you see a dog head like this here, always calling on blindy, blinding, you better shut the fuck up because I know that you've been traumatized. I know that you came from a traumatized environment. You better get the fucking help that you need. When you see Blondie coming out here and she having to say, uh, 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 check the, check the, <laughs> it ain't funny. Cause you know, she's, a, she's in elt. She's, she got some imperative. She, she's in peril and some, something ain't right, right with, with, with this motherfucker now. Um, I, slow bus. She need the day, day to go pull out the money for this day, day to go pull out the money for that. Let me tell you something. It's a reason behind all that shit. No power was part of that scam. Porcelain, uh, porcelain doll was a part of that scam. When you hear no power, we're talking about porcelain, uh, porcelain doll and all this shit. Did she say porcelain doll or? It may have been Porcelain Doll. Or maybe goddamn got the name wrong. She's a part of it too. Okay. If I mispronounced that her name, no power called out a name that was it that, that, that was this this relevant. It's the motherfucker that did them jackets that time and gave them jackets. So whoever that bitch is, she's another one with fake pages. I believe you, DJ. Simple minds think all payments are hand to hand. However, most are not looking at the Google payments, VI views, and monetization. Money is not always hand to hand. No, it's not. It's uh, sometimes it's le it's electronically. When she when she come out here and say um. You know, it's electronically done, but when she came out here and said that she make all that money on one video, you know, like I said, she's not a big, big content creator. That's because they filtering that money. They washing that money, in my opinion. You go back and you they audit that goddamn channel. They look at that channel. It, she's audited. If they audit that shit, it's them numbers ain't going to goddamn something is off. Something is off. I can tell you that. 
That's because they pumping, they money laundering, in my opinion, that they pumping that money and they washing that shit through these channels. And they feel, and see, see Gator, was, Gator said premeditated, fuck that shit. If it's true, it's true. I don't, and, and it, it makes sense. I don't understand why people watch who they don't like. They be your, they be in your bushes and deep. Yesterday made a whole video about it. They be in your bushes deep. Yesterday made a whole video about it. Okay, I mean, you know, I know how they roll. I don't give a fuck. They, I hope they don't get cut up in the bushes. A uh, fuck up. I don't give a fuck about the bit in my bush. You got to understand something where I'm at mentally. I, I've been this. I've been in this place over a year. I don't care. See, I don't care. This is not, this ain't the move for me. But if you put my name in your mouth and I'm just over here doing commentary and I say you a scammer too, you go back on your platform, you calling me delusional and all these things, don't think it's not going to be a response. Because you was warned that if you got them speak on my name, I'm going to got them come back and it's going to be whoop the whoop. I said this. I would be less than a woman to not to stand on what I said, punk bitch. Because it don't matter who the fuck with you, Callie. My God, today I feel like the bushes to let you know you're speaking big facts. Thank you, uh, HQ. This ain't YouTube universe of hell trying to correct... It, uh, uh, okay, had a pronunciation is a distraction tactic. Fuck what they say about me. They need to go over there and correct goddamn uh 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 motherfucking puppies. She talk crazy all the motherfucking time. They don't go out there and correct her. Fuck them motherfucking trick ass bitches. They still ain't got the skill set that I motherfucking got. They ain't got the heart that I got. They ain't got the heart that I motherfucking got. Let's be clear. They ain't got the motherfucking heart that I got. You got to, hey, baby, you in this shit, this, this shit, they ain't, they ain't nothing, ain't nothing good about this shit. This ain't, this ain't the move. But see, I just got enough sense. I come out here and I got damn talk about it. You feel me? I ain't going to got damn sit up and not speak on if you calling out my name. You think I ain't, ain't going to be no motherfucking rebuttal. Baby, we, we, we going to talk about it. Because I got some shit on every motherfucking body. Just because I don't come out here talking about certain shit. This because if you ain't fucking with me, hell, I ain't going to fuck with you. But if you fuck with me, I'm going to go there. I'm not afraid of these people. I'm not afraid of these people. These people ain't going to scare me. If anybody going to do the back and it's going to be me. Uh, this ain't YouTube University. Exactly. So, you know. Fuck them. Understand that it was a money grab. Understand when they come out here and talk about uh see she just is she just as worse as they are because she allowed a lot of stuff to happen. Like I said, I don't I don't know how deep this shit is, but it's deep. It's 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 so it's, it's deep, it could be deeper than what I see. But anytime you got this, 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 just look at this individual right here. You love to see and be on people bushes while they talk shit about you. I understand, Callie. You was a part of the Holloway family being scammed. And I came on my live. I remember it like it was yesterday. I, I think I put you and Chase picture up. I put you in Chase pitch up. I said, you dog head bitch. I said, I dare you. I said, I dare you come out here and play on the heartstrings and try to play like you fucking innocent. And you were in bitch, you older than 51. Let's be clear. 
you way older than 51. Way older than 51. See, in your head, you think somebody trying to take something from you, but you got to understand everything come to an end at some point. You cannot do business as usual, usual, operating in the same environment, expecting the same results. Ray Charles can see through the bullshit. If I do something consistently over and over and over and over and over, year after year after year, see, you don't even have the ability to even change because you don't even have that skill set. And when a motherfucker said that you was complacent, that means you're complacent in your mind. That's the reason why you operate like you do. The motherfuckers ain't even got the ability to even tell you that, you know what, this ain't working no more. Because what has happened is you have a new level of thinkers, researchers that has came in. That's the reason why I was so problematic. That's the reason why you said, by all means necessary, I want this bitch gone. And you was willing to walk two miles. Who are they? Those beasts are nothing to be scared of. The only thing that they do is call institutions. But that's going to come to an end, too. There's work being done uh, right now. Uh, this bitch is privy to. Uh, medical information as much as she come out here and say oh this that and the other she's privy of she fuck with them as well they into insurance fraud they into goddamn all types of shit claims claims let me run it back to you claims they know about a lot of shit because they dab in the shit you don't know about nothing unless you dabbing into it. So when you see these motherfuckers come out here and play these uh, 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 intimidation tactics, all you got to do is back them up in the corner and get them in, in fucking law enforcement. Them bitches are fold like a goddamn faux leaf clover. They scared of being fingerprinted because when you be fingerprinted, you already know, motherfucker, it's going to trace who you are in real time. They scared of a goddamn precinct and a motherfucking police station. That's the reason why when a bitch tried to go in that motherfucking police station and she said something about, can you tell if it's a fake ID? He said, no, I, they make fake IDs all the fucking time. See, bitch, you had already, what's up with you? You think I'm goddamn scared of you going, let me go to the police department. Let me go to the police department, oh, DJ. Fuck you, trick, bitch. I don't give a fuck about no motherfucking police department that you go to. Trying to prove yourself. Trying to motherfucking prove yourself that you ain't who you are. And the motherfucker said, it, 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 people make fake IDs all the time. Bitch, you was a bold bitch that day because you felt that you needed to fucking prove a point. Because I'm going to tell you something, Callie. Give it time. Bitch, you think it's a game. You are, when you when I say you commentary, that means, bitch, you commentary. That means that everything that you've said, anything that come out about you, bitch, you're going to have to wear all of that. Bitch, I, go get your team ready. Get your team, Kelly. Get your people. Get your people. Because I'm telling you today, I don't fear you. I don't fear the motherfucking enterprise. You all motherfuckers fear me more than I fear you. And what you fear is information. Because you know the information is dangerous. And let me tell you something. You the one got to come out here and win me and try to make it seem like you this and that. Bitch, you ain't shit. See, you hide, you hide behind no power accomplishments. <laughs> you hide, you hide, you hide behind no power. That ain't got no power. I remember when they was coming in my chat saying uh, she was on the couch or something, therapy or whatever. Like I said, trauma house. 
Liars always seek validation. Why do I got to seek validation from fucking strangers that I don't know? You think I give a fuck about what you say about me? You think when I end this live, I give a fuck about what you say about me on this live when I tap out this bitch? I'm going on about my day. I'm going to do what I do. You ain't going to stop me. You ain't going to goddamn do shit. It ain't going to happen. Blondie. Blondie may have, may have came up out of South Carolina. She may have been in South Carolina at some point. But like I said. Like I said, people, give it time. Give it time. Give it time. One thing they always told me, what don't, what don't come out in the wash, it'll come out in the rinse. i never forget, I may have fucked around and showed a picture of an image of somebody. Because see, they, 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 can't, they can't sit the fuck still. <laughs> And I said, what the fuck is this? Because, you know, people send me stuff. I may not respond to you. But I'm always going to circle that blog. I think I showed an image of a, of, of a lady that was incarcerated for fucking with children. I'm going to add that to the list. Because it was people that used to be in my chat that was, you know, over there with Blondie. And the only reason why you did that is because you also know what's up. See, you need to understand something. These people know a lot of shit that they didn't never want to come out. So keep paying your agents, keep paying your people to come out and do fuck shit. But you can't pay me off. You will never pay me off. I see you, chef. I'm gone. This time I'm really gone. They can't, they can't pay me off. Look at her mouth. That's Daffy Duck. That's Daffy Duck. I don't care what they put out on me. And DJ, tell them that you don't care and to let them know how much you don't care for what? I don't have I don't know. I don't give a fuck. Follow up with the fact that you don't care, that you don't care. That's how much you don't. <laughs> Baby, I'm cold with it, though. I, I, I know it. I can be so cold. Motherfucker. <laughs> Motherfucker was trying to confide in me about some shit about a situation. I'm, they said, this thing, why do you cannot? <laughs> they said, why you just cannot have some type of compassion? Because I say the stupidity. You want my head to go somewhere where it's not able to go. You want my head. You want me to, you want my head. My thinking ability to go somewhere where I'm not capable of going because it's stupid. Why do you want me to feel something that I'm not able to feel? Because I cannot relate. And then you trying to make convince me to have emotion about something that I'm, I'm incapable of having. What the fuck? And people will get mad at you because you don't have, you don't feel the way they feel. Look, motherfucker, you can't make me feel something that I don't feel. When they came out here, they came out here and they said, uh, her sister, her sister. I said, God damn, what is it in a problem? Let's put her sister up. Maybe that's going to stop her. 
said, what the fuck? Let's go. That's all you got? I don't give two fucks. You want to dox? Bitch, I'm going to dox the bitch myself in real time. They wanted me to feel some type of emotion behind that. And I couldn't feel shit. And all of them, including this duck trick mouth. I can't stay say, God damn. <laughs> it's called I Don't Give a Fuck. And this is the same bitch that sits on her platform and talks about the way someone looks. And this is what she's giving. Hoagie, uh, sit your mother. <laughs> Hoagie, sit your motherfucking ass <laughs> Yeah, that's a, that's hoagie. That's funky. That, that, let me tell you something. Rod just was filthy as she wanted to be. Rod, you no, know, she ain't shit. Rod's come out the cornfields. But she play a good role. Now, she has been exposed to certain shit. She tried to level up and say, I don't do that. I'm just a clean person. I don't have that type of lifestyle. Hi, Sway. We see you with the dope man. We seen you with the dope, man. Look like you had, may have a little powder residue stuck in your nostrils that day. Don't tell me I ain't got the video. Was it snot? Was it a booger? <laughs> or was it goddamn residue from that goddamn cocaine? She had to, I said, God damn, Ross. You know, no power going to be mad at you for this shit. You better clean this up. That motherfucker, that motherfucker was high as a Georgia pine, had that hen in hen, had that goddamn blunt, let that mask down, Ross. Show them how it's done, Callie. Show them what you be really doing, motherfucker. She said, I'm celebrating. Celebrate what? What's up? Only thing, you bitch, you was getting high in real motherfucking time with a motherfucker. That cocaine had you where you couldn't even motherfucking cry. I put a motherfucking white horse, bitch. And I put her face right beside that goddamn white pony. I said, bitch, you been riding that motherfucker all night long. You better come up. I said, bitch, you, <laughs> bitch, you better come up for some out. I said, bitch, you better come up for some out, motherfucker. Uh, hey, y'all, Lady DJ and Steph has got to catch the replay. Model saying, I see you, uh, dear hearts. Let's see. DJ, Chef Mac ain't shit either. But Chef, Chef, no, I know, motherfucker. You better stop playing, Chef. Stop playing, Chef. DJ, that was the coldest move ever on YouTube. DJ said, I'm about to dox my sister. Let's go. Say, let's go, baby. We ain't going to. Let's get it. You want to play these doxing games? <laughs> you want to play these doxing games? I'm going to dox the bitch myself. Let's get it. Let's go. It feel good to me. I couldn't even get on live quick enough. Fuck that shit. You're going to think you're going to play games with me. I'm going to dox the bitch myself. Why not be cold with it? Atonement moments. You got to meet the moment. You got to be in the moment. When a motherfucker try to back you in a corner, you got to say, what's up with you? What's up with you? You think you going to motherfucking play these games with me? And think you're going to dox somebody? Not supposed to sit back and not come out here and be ashamed? Be ashamed of what? You can't motherfucking intimidate me. How you gonna intimidate a motherfucker that I, I, I have a uh I can intimidate sometimes? How you gonna intimidate a fucking intimidator? Intimidator? <laughs> how you how you gonna how you gonna timid me? What I supposed to be scared of? What do I supposed to be scared of? A bitch that's on the internet because you calling my name. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. She going to come and knock. They going to do. I, what I saw is what? You can't get me in that state of mind of being scared of you bitches. What I supposed to be afraid of? You ain't proven yet that by, we still waiting on you to get this goddamn information about this motherfucking baby that you said a 54, 50, I think he's 54 or 55, 54 or 55. A man that you that, that is old, you said that Bobby is pumping out goddamn babies. <laughs> Bobby pumping out goddamn babies. Bobby ain't pumping out nothing, bitch. 
Bobby, that silicone valley, bitch, he ain't pumping out nothing. You want me to, you want the people to believe that Bobby, old man, old man pumping out babies, but they lie. He ain't pumping out no goddamn babies. That's the reason why your bitch ass, uh, you and Blindy couldn't produce. Let, go ahead. We'll find out who the fuck her daddy is. Go ahead. Who the fuck her daddy is? Because you said you was fucking Dave. You said that you was fucking David. How about that? But come to find out, bitch, you ain't fucked David, and David ain't putting nothing up in you. David, just like goddamn uh, Dwayne, he ain't fucked you. He could be a motherfucking relative of yours, bitch. He ain't fucked you. I know that, bitch. You lie. Why do you have to lie so much? They talking about Papa, Papa had. Let's put allergic up. Papa. Papa had. Papa wasn't sticking that shit. Papa maybe have been a Rolling Stone, but he wasn't fucking that. She do look like Papa. She look like Papa. Who are you at, Alert? She look like Poppy. There go Alert. That's what Ocean said. That's Alert. Papa was a rolling stone. Allergic got Creole in her too. I believe that. I believe she got some goddamn Creole or something in her. But now, she came out here and said something about Ocean when he put out this damn picture. I said, what the fuck is going on here? Papa was a rolling stone. Look at her distinctive glasses, guys. Papa was a rolling stone, but he wasn't fucking you. She kind of favor allergic a little bit. I don't know, allergic. You got some... uh. Black folks in your family somewhere? Papa was a rolling stone. They ought to stop that shit talking about Poppy was fucking Cali. Poppy wasn't fucking that motherfucker. This bitch is doing all this scamming and won't get that motherfucking grill <laughs> fixed. I'm hollering. She's scared to go to the orthodontist. Atomic Mama said it looks like Dodo. That's what Lot Lizard said. DJ said that old silicone <laughs> valley bear ain't popping out. No, that motherfucker ain't popping out no goddamn babies. I know that he may he, he, he might have been popping out something, you know, uh, the younger years, but that motherfucker ain't popping out. No, that motherfucker ain't popping out shit. Not not like that. He may have been popping, he may have been popping something, you know, early, you know, but that motherfucker ain't popping shit, Silicon Valley. Silicon Valley, motherfucker ain't pumping out here. God, you got a, you got a little bait up. <laughs> you got a little sister somewhere that you don't know nothing about. That motherfucker ain't gonna hold. He ain't gonna keep shit from Kaya. He will tell Kaya every motherfucking thing. Kaya whole secret to the end, baby. That's a that's the rider. Look at look 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 at Tommy. Mama, Tommy, Mama said that um Dodo looked like a uh, allergic. Mm. Somebody somewhere gave this picture to Ocean. Somebody somewhere gave this picture to Ocean. She almost flipped out. This motherfucker. But what she did was <laughs> she went in on legend in India. She went in, what she did was, she went in on Lot Lizza in India, and not too long after that, she, I think India lost a sister or somebody, but she started going in. I said, what the fuck is this shit about? This shit deep. It make a little sense now. Mm. God damn. Rod Squad forever. Dope forever. It's forever, ever. 
ever have her? Ever, ever. We, 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 we strong. You ain't going to fuck with us, DJ. You fucking delusional. You in 333, you going to fucking stop. I can't stop. I won't stop. You should have told her to shut the fuck up. Now, these goddamn kids, they came from every fucking way. I don't know where the fuck. I mean, they came from every goddamn which kind of way. But they didn't come out that goddamn, but she don't even know how to, uh, to uh, she ain't never had a goddamn labor pain. She don't know how I feel to have a fucking labor pain and being fucking labor all fucking day long, hollering and twisting and goddamn turning. Can't get no motherfucking relief. Wishing that you never goddamn uh, got jacked up. And then you got the nerve to come out here and say that Bobby, 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 little Holly, Bobby, they. Silicon Valley, like he pumping out some some juice to get somebody goddamn pregnant. That motherfucker ain't pumping out no goddamn juice that's going to pump nobody up. Okay. Now, I'm not talking about Bobby, but I'm talking about Bobby. He's a good person. But he ain't, he ain't out here pumping. That motherfucker ain't pumping nothing. Ain't nobody that's gonna get somebody pregnant. So when Miss Carver come out here and say that uh she was fucking Papa, Bobby, you ought to stop Carver. How long you gonna play this game, Carver? She was not fucking Poppy. Poppy had somebody that he was already sticking, and he was not sticking Callie. Okay, stop that shit. Stop the madness. Look at allergic. Allergic said she was a gangster. <laughs> she said that she was a motherfucking soldier. Okay. She detested 333 and delusional. She called me the bearded lady. This is what she did. Now you gonna fucking stop talking about raw squad. When you went to Las Vegas, you wanted to let me know. I said, God damn, my fiend, my fiend up. You wanted to let me know that you was with the motherfucking Sopranos. You made sure that you let me know. And you wanted to let me know, motherfucker, it, 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 it's, it's up. I'm a gangster. Where you at? That's what I'm going to tell you something. Hey. Same nose. <laughs> huh? Them little beady eyes. I don't know. Allergic. It's something down in that goddamn Creole water down in Louisiana. I don't know. Somebody said allergic, and this is not funny. Uh, somebody said allergic was six, and somebody said that she was deceased. I don't know. Now, y'all know how I feel about the deceased, so I'm not going to talk about uh, nobody that's deceased, but we know these people play a lot of games. But I did hear uh, on the back end that allergic was twin. Where you? Where have you been, twin? Where have you been? <laughs> Somebody did tell me that allergic was sick. Like I said, people, it's it's possible, but I don't know. I'm not gonna talk about you. Only the things that you have put out. I don't know if she's alive. I don't know if she's expired. I don't know. That man ain't trying to pay child support out of social security, out of his social security check. Yeah, and, and, and like I said, motherfuckers still alive and kicking. She want people to believe everybody deceased, everybody dead, everybody whoop the whoop, fake tombstones, all this shit. But you never took us to your motherfucking mama's uh, birth, I mean, um, graveside. 
grace. She said, great, great, great side, grave side. You never did that. You said you was going to take us on a field trip. We ain't been yet. By the looks of it, she can't see three. You and nobody else. Well, they say that this is this is allergic. Huh. Remember when Callie said that she was going on a field trip? She was going to take us to the grave, grave site. She was going after she fed the homeless people. What happened? You put out the fake tombstone. You turned around and had Rita come out here and pump that fucking narrative. And they told her to shut the fuck up. Allegedly, people, this is allergic. You do the math. Think about it. Baby, they're going to be mad today. Damn. Ooh.